my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Maddie and today I'm gonna to be giving you a little tour of my little flat so um, if you follow me on social media you'll know that I'm actually moving house which is super exciting however I am gonna be very very sad to leave this flat behind because I've poured so much love and so much care into this flat. I moved in here two years ago um, and it's been my first place that I've lived without my parents. So yeah, I've really, really tried to build a lot of storage into this flat. So I thought this might be useful for those of you who have a really small space to work with and you just want some inspiration. If you know me, you'll know I have a lot of stuff. I've got a lot of clothes and a lot of makeup. So I needed to build some stuff storage to put it all in yeah let's just show you around this is the view as you come in hello baby <laughs> this is usually what happens lola comes to greet me hi gorgeous are you gonna help me do the flat tour no okay so on the left as you walk in i have my key holder which is just this magnetic like cloud thing from tiger and then on the right hand side i have these hooks which are from Maisons de Mons and um, yeah I've just hung like bags and like an umbrella and stuff on here. I've only got a few because I've done a clear route and the rest of them are in my wardrobe. Um, I also have these mirrors here which I absolutely love. I feel like mirrors just make a place look a lot bigger um, and this is from TK Maxx. I just absolutely love like how it looks. And you can get a glimpse of the flat in them. Um, then on this side I have my little Ikea cabinet so I have a lot of these like square ones in my flat you'll see um, and you can pick whatever baskets you want for them so I've gone for these grey ones um, in these I mean I don't even know if I'll be able to pull them out but the top two are like stuff that I've been sent recently like products um, from brands and then in the bottom two I've got shampoo and conditioner oh god it's so heavy and then um, in here was like my hair products and then I have this little I think it's actually a fruit bowl so this I just chuck like everything in and then this fake plant from Ikea with a lovely gold plant pot I just feel like this helps to separate the space because this space is all open plan like it's really nice to have a kind of um hallway i then have this little basket which just has like my everyday shoes in and then up here i built some more storage up the top these are literally just ikea shelves but these are for all of my black boots slash heels um, I do actually have a ladder like everyone's like how do you reach them but I have a ladder because I can't reach them myself although my boyfriend can because he is very tall so that's that area and then we move on down into the lounge so I have this sofa which is literally just from Ikea I really like the kind of L shapes of it because again I feel like it really helps separate the space um, I just have this I mean ideally I wouldn't have this here but I have this to put all my like blogger mail packages in this is actually a sofa bed so you literally just pull this bit out and it creates a massive sofa bed which is so useful for when people come to stay and then the cushions on here are just from like various places and then I have my picture wall up here which I absolutely love I've gone for like um, a kind of pink like a very soft pink theme and like green plants kind of in keeping with like the cushions where I've got um the lovely like green and blue cushions um so yeah pretty much all of these are from decenio this one is wonky but we'll just ignore that <laughs> um so yeah that's that and then this oh my god this is probably one of the best investments i've made you need to get yourself one of these if you don't have a dining table like me um there's no space to have a dining table so this little table acts as a work table when I want to work sat on my sofa it acts as my dining room table I've got this little like non-slip mat on it um which is really great oh and also when the sofa bed's out 
my guests move it around to here and have it as a side table. So, 20 quid from Ikea, honestly. You need to get yourself one of these. And I think they come in different colours. Like, I think there was actually a gold one. So then, moving all around, we have my work area. I really wanted to have a view. Um, like, well, it's not really much of a view, but it's something. Like, you know, we've got blue skies today. There's some trees. Um, this is my little front garden. So I got my desk from Wayfair. I really like the kind of... Um, design of it i bought this little chair it's just a velvet chair from um ebay and then i just i mean i have various things i dotted around this lamp isn't even plugged in but we have like a copper lamp a fake plant again from ikea just a bowl of perfumes a thing for pens i think this is from uh either h&m or maison's demand i'll link where everything is from below this is just a picture that i have of my family and then this mirror which i got in a random like blogger mail package but i absolutely love it because it's like marble it also came with this which i've just put underneath these bits um and then yeah i mean i've just got my wi-fi and like candles and that's from primark this lamp is from Wayfair, I think. Again, I've never used this, but I think it looks really nice in the corner. Um, and then behind, I've just got like these little storage baskets, which I think were from Home Bargains. So many like decorations. <laughs> I went a bit crazy when I moved in and then I was like, oh, I don't know where I'm gonna put these. Um, I also have these, which was supposed to be my chest of drawers, just pushing that one in. Um, but they're so tall, like they're taller than my desk. Um, and they just did not work next to my bed. But I thought I could keep them as like my like filing cabinet. So I've just got loads of like paper and stuff in there. And then I've got candle. This is from accessories, I think fake cactus from Sainsbury's this is from Debenhams and then this I can't remember where this is from my little basil plant and then this is a piggy bank this is such a good spot for people watching when I'm sitting here doing my work I mean you know you see all sorts of people walking past here and it's just yeah it's a really nice like area to sit in so again I like that that's kind of like a separate area where I can do my work and then this clock which isn't on it doesn't have the batteries in because I don't like ticking clocks I think this was from Asta um it's really nice though it's copper and then we move around to the TV unit the rug by the way which Lola is modeling <laughs> is from made.com I absolutely love this but it is high maintenance it's hard to keep clean i have to hoover it pretty much every day because it yeah the fluff is just yeah especially when this one's on it <laughs> look at her uh, looking all angelic hi baby um so yeah i absolutely love my tv unit it this bottom one is what it's like and then i had these two um things up on the wall i was gonna put them up on the wall here but i had them up on the wall on my old bedroom and then my builder suggested that i just build them on top and luckily like it's been this is strong enough to hold them because there's a lot of stuff in them so i have all of these drawers um it's just like random stuff so this hey this is my like cables drawer and then pretty much the rest of them are makeup look at that there's a drawer of lipsticks we've got a drawer of mascaras and then i've got like eyeshadows and everything eyeshadow palettes and then my sunglasses in the end um so yeah that's that and then i've just got like little um i can't remember where this is from maybe wilco it's got some sunglasses in this surround sound system i don't even use i've just put it in there to fill up space have an eyeliner don't even use it but yeah again i've just popped like random bits to make this area look really cute this little thing is from h&m it's got like a random i got given that for my birthday so <laughs> i kept that there and then this tv is 42 inches i think and then again like in these you can put whatever baskets you want so i've just got i mean i had these before these wicker baskets which i think look really good this is just i mean this is like all my camera storage in there and i've got like just face masks and eyelashes in there just like honestly i've just got so much stuff you guys i've got hair stuff in there some fake tan and this bottom one. Oh my god i can't even get it out that's all fake tan in there so yeah that's that and then 
we've got these little like i wanted to have like space and then drawers doors and a wicker basket again so yes i mean i've just got random i don't even know what's in there and then this little area oh sorry lola just stepped on her how aesthetic is that i got this actually at an event that i went to it was like my um place name so i took that back and put it up there this is from sainsbury's i think and then i've just got a candle and then this which i've been sent in a random package a fake plant from ikea and then a little oh this already had champagne in it so i've just kept it so it looks cute um this bag from sketch i took leftovers from an afternoon tea in and i thought it went so well with my decor that i kept it this is from this matches the candle over there um accessorized it's got some like rings here like it's just random like trinkets on here this is from h&m ages ago um but again like in these drawers i don't even know if i'll be able to open it that is all like foundation in there and then i'm not really sure what's in there concealer and highlighter um i've got just like um filing systems in there there's like hair products in here and in here and um we've got perfume in there and then i've got my little flamingo light up there and a thing of that's all sun cream in there i keep my hoover here i did have one of those slimline vax ones but it did nothing like let me tell you it was so weak so um actually my boyfriend's mom was chucking out her hoover so she gave me this and it fits pretty well in there but it's just it's one of the things about this house is that i just don't have any storage cupboards to put things like my ironing board and my hoover and stuff away in and then we're on to the kitchen so this i'll pop a picture of what this looked like um when i bought it so it was actually wood and instead of putting a whole new kitchen in and i think i've done a pretty good job however i will not like i don't know if you'll be able to notice but there are little patches that really really annoy me so basically some of the paint had chipped off and recently i repainted them to make it look a bit nicer but the paint is not gone the same so it's yeah you can see like in certain areas like it annoys me but i don't know whether you would necessarily be able to notice it when you walk in so i just literally picked up this paint from being q it's like a gray color which i really really love and then i spray painted the handles i didn't even buy new copper handles again i just got a can of that from being q um so yeah this is the kit this is the tidiest that my kitchen has ever ever been <laughs> so yeah there's lots of storage in the kitchen obviously we have like the oven and the hob there and then i've got my washer dryer in there which i've put my bed sheets in because they need to be washed um this little copper drying rack is from wilco and then i actually built well i didn't but i got my builder to build this little shelf in he did a really good job because then i can keep like all my cookbooks on here some hand cream and just this cute little light and i really like how it turned out obviously as you can see i'm obsessed with copper so we've got all these different copper accessories i actually spray painted this as well because this is just from ikea just holds like a load of stuff in i love this um kitchen roll holder so nice i can't remember where that's from but i'll link it my microwave was from donnell mill i believe and then i've just got like this candle and a fake plant on the top i've got my fruit bowl which is actually full of fruit for once i can't remember this is from like one of the supermarkets i think um this grater is so cool my sister got me this for um christmas i think it was from tk maxx really really love that uh so that is all that and then my kettle and my toaster i think these are from wilco um but i absolutely love these and then as if i didn't have enough storage in my kitchen already i got these baskets for up top i think they look okay i'm not crazy about them but i got these i can't remember again i'm gonna have to find out and link them below but they fit really well along here so i've got all these small ones which have like stuff in them and then um yeah 
up here up here up here and then my boyfriend's coffee machine is up there if you want me to do like a more in-depth tour of like opening all of these covers and showing you what's inside then i can do if you're interested but yeah just to give you a little sneak peek i'm not gonna go through them all because it's gonna take me so long but um this is just my glasses slash mug cupboard and it's so disorganized right now this is the fridge in here and then the freezer here not that exciting so originally i did actually have the bin under here because i've got a recycling bin in this one but i wanted well let me just i might as well show you now um it's an absolute state but i wanted to have more space for all my cleaning products blame mrs hinch <laughs> so i got this copper bin which was from home bargains i mean i'm not crazy about having it out but i think i mean it's sleek it looks cool this is lola's um little area for her food and drink and then yeah i have these two little poster things load of random stuff up there <laughs> and then i have this cupboard which i built in so i think it fits so well i got this from ikea and this is so useful i put all of my coats in here this is pretty much just like a stuff cupboard it's not very neat but i've literally just shoved like shoes up there and then there's two things down here full of like that's my trainers and then this one is full of heels that's that cupboard and i like that it has a mirror as well this is where if you watch all my try on hauls god these jeans are so big for me um you'll see me like doing this here and then my little washing basket i can't remember where that's from so sorry if this is really long um in we go to the bathroom wow that light has gone so yellow that's hideous there we go that's a lot better that's so weird that the camera didn't correct itself um so when i moved in the bathroom looks like this i put like new flooring new bath new shower everything the only thing i left was like the toilet and the sink because they were absolutely fine but i changed the taps so i absolutely love my floor in here and then i got pretty much like this whole wall and then all the way across here and the splashback tiled with these um what are they called Oh my god i've forgotten the name of them they're like brick and i put like a gray grout um in them to make them stand out which again i really love like i feel like i'm gonna duplicate this wherever i go because this is so me i put this waterfall shower in um and i've just got this little like thing for my razors which is from wilco i think um my makeup's here i don't like how this looks but we'll just leave it there again i've built in more storage this just has like um linen and towels in it um and yeah this bath mat is from h&m and then i've just got various bits and bobs like how cool is this though i got sent this from ogx which is me on a shampoo i don't think i'm ever gonna use that it's just gonna sit there and i've got like a fake plant and these little baskets which are from primer that have various things in i again built in storage here and here so we've got a massive cupboard which i absolutely love um i love this like wood contrast obviously i had to have a copper toilet brush um and then i've got more copper storage i think this was from tk maxx copper bin from asda um this can't remember where that was from asda again i think and then i have this cabinet which is from ikea this just has all my skincare in it um yeah it's a lot and then i've shoved away my boyfriend's toothbrush in there and then all of my these are pretty much my daily perfumes which are all pink that i have up there um heated towel rail and then on the back of the door we just have these hooks for all of my towels luckily they all coordinate today so yeah that is that oh yeah and i also forgot to mention that i've got more storage built in up there which just has random stuff in it and then this light was actually here before i came as was the one in here which is copper the only one i put in was this copper one for the kitchen 
So yeah, now we're moving on to my bedroom. If you actually watched the video of my bedroom tour, then you'll have already seen it. I have actually added something in since though. So yeah, this is my bedroom. Um, behind the door, which is really annoying, I keep my um, ironing board and the ladder that I use to get up to the high places. So I've got like hats and scarves up there see like my dressing gowns and stuff on the back i've got just some rugs to make it a bit more homey because i don't really ha like having wood in the bedroom i've got tv on the wall this was supposed to go here but i was going to originally have a dressing area here i don't even know why i just wanted a dressing area but it i mean i've got that much space so it didn't work out so now i have a really inspirational um photo this is a great quote <laughs> I'm joking obviously and then I've got storage for all of my makeup which I need to clear out up here um massive like wardrobes I just got these from Ikea and I absolutely love like I chose the layout of this and I absolutely love like how it looks and how I can just close it away this is the other one um so yeah, this is all my stuff. This is the extent of Sam, my boyfriend's stuff at the moment. And then, I'll show you in a second, I did actually give him like chests of drawers, but these are all my bags and like just, just clothes and bags and suitcases and everything in there. And then at the end, we've got dresses and then ski stuff, a random laser removal thing, and then more clothes down there. This is what I added in. So originally, I mean, you can still open this door, so I'll show you out there in a sec, but um, I added another set of squares in since I did my room tour because my boyfriend just had no storage and he doesn't, like, live live with me. Well, he does, but, like, do you know what I mean? Like, he literally can't. Like, this is... <laughs> I have no space. Um, so, yeah, I, th I mean, I think these look pretty cool here. Um... Again, these are all from Ikea, so he's just got all his stuff in here, which I won't go through. Um, got a little candle, throw her in a basket. This was originally where I'd been, but yeah, that's actually a picnic basket thing. And then I've got one of these, which I absolutely love. Again, we've got another rug on the floor here. And then this, which was originally going to be the store for my dressing area, is now a very handy um bedside table this is just from Maisons de Monde so this line goes up to um reveal this is like the little courtyard area and then there's like a garden at the back um so yeah that's that you can use this door it's like a stable door but I tend to just use the front door this bed which I will show you it lifts up which again, I need all the storage I can get. Um, and then this is from TK Maxx. These are from Massillon, those are from Next. So the bed just goes up like that. And I literally got so much stuff under here. My little lights on here, I got from Ikea because I couldn't have bedside lamps. So I thought this was really clever. Like I saw this unit in Ikea and then I thought, oh, I can stick these lights on underneath. and perfect like bedside lights and then i just got loads of random stuff up there but i have makeup in here i need to go through these lipsticks because i rarely ever go in these cupboards but again this is just full of random stuff like books and whatnot and in there is like more makeup more makeup i have a portrait of myself i got sent this in a pr package a little bit weird but whatever absolutely love this quote this is from Decenio again it's a bit wrinkly though um so yeah that is everything in here that's literally the flat so i really hope you enjoyed this video and i hope it gave you some inspo if you are moving into a smaller space i will link obviously everything that i can think of that i showed you guys in the description below it's gonna be a very long description um but let me know if you want me to go into more detail in like the kitchen or the bathroom give it a thumbs up if you did like it and um subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and i will see you all in monday's video goodbye